So I was looking through some of the videos I made earlier this year, um, seeing if some of my predictions were right. And I posted a video about different bullion coins and my pick for the best America the Beautiful 5 ounce coin of the 2014 series. And I said I'm going to put my money on Utah and I'm pretty glad that I did. Because uh, if you look at the Everglades, uh, they're $108 here on Atmex. Uh, Great Sand Dunes are $108 as well. The Arches are $208. The Shenandoah is $102. And the Great Smoky Mountains are $105. And so the Arches are $100 more than any of the other coins. So it definitely has performed the best. And I think it's going to continue to perform. Uh, the reason, Another reason why I said that Utah, I think it would be the best coin, is because I knew people that lived in Utah. Um, uh, Utah is Mormon country, and a lot of Mormons uh, like precious metals. Preparedness is part of their religion, so silver is part of being prepared for, you know, whatever. It's uh, self-reliance, it's not having to worry about how many paper dollars you have so I think that Utah definitely likes its silver and I also said that I think that Utah has more precious metals per capita than any other state and I think that that's part of the reason is because a lot of Mormons have a lot of silver and a lot of gold so uh, I think that that coin is going to continue to increase in value and looking at the prices of the other four that are still available, I would say that the Sand Dunes is probably the bargain of the bunch. Um, you know, I I wouldn't pay $208 for an arch because I got them for much less, but uh, I think that the Great Sand Dunes are probably a bargain at 108 And uh, the Shenandoahs are 102 but I really don't, care for that design as much it just really doesn't strike me as odd um, the great great smoky mountains is a cool design but i believe it's going to have a higher mintage because that's when silver was up and that's when people were comfortable buying these five ounce coins um, and i think the everglades is also going to have a high mintage because of the drop in the price uh, the timing of this one it came out, you know, silver was almost at its bottom. The bottom that we've seen so far, I should say. So, yeah, I think the Everglades is going to draw in a lot of new investors. People that, you know, don't have the other coins of the series. Whereas, I think that the arches are going to continue to improve. But I think that the best buy right now is probably the Great Sand Dunes. And I haven't seen the 2015 designs but I think that the Homestead, Nebraska, and the Blue Ridge Parkway, I think those are going to be the coins to get. I haven't even seen the designs, but um, I definitely think that those are going to be the ones that I'm going to want. Uh, hopefully they come out with some decent designs. And I'll post a video uh, as soon as I'm able to see these designs and see what they look like. Well, anyways, have a great day. Thanks for watching, and let me know what you think about these arches. Is that crazy or what? And these are just the bullion versions.